Hello everybody, welcome back to Dying Light. Today I've got another blueprint location guide for you guys and I'm going to be showing you exactly where to get the blueprint for the right hand of Glover which is like a bomb grenade mod kind of thing. Uh, so there's two locations of places you need to actually uh, go to before you actually go to the place where you get the blueprint. The first one you'll see on screen now is at the very top of the map. Uh, I'll bring the map up for you in a second for that and uh, you want to go to the very top of the island in Old Town and uh, we're going to be in like a little fort kind of castle area and uh, just to the end uh, of this little place, this island uh, there's going to be a tower, you're going to climb it and um, halfway up there's like this uh, small round ball um, it looks a bit like dark matter actually from Future Armor if you uh, look at it closely but uh, basically when you get onto it you're actually going to uh, see that it says unknown but you want to pick it up anyway, we're going to need two of these in all and uh, it's a little bit of an easter egg really this, I'll explain all about it later but for now I will show you where to get it, so that was the first one and uh, from there you're going to want to run to the very bottom of the island to uh, this big massive fort that's right at the bottom of the island and uh, to the left hand side, again the map location will be up uh, so you can see exactly where to go uh, you want to basically run down a massive hill all the way to the very bottom on the side of this cliff and uh, there's a beach at the bottom and things like that and basically at the end of this beach on the left hand side you're going to see a very small another ball of uh, shall we say dark matter it's like an orb or whatever it is again that will say unknown on it but you need to pick these two things up before you do anything and uh, once you pick them two things up you can actually uh, take them to a place and uh, activate the uh, right hand glover easter egg which will give you the blueprint so uh, there is the two items picked up now anyway and uh, there's a map reference once again for you uh, to see where to take it so once you've got the two things that you need to actually uh, get it we're going to come to this building here and uh, i'll bring that up on the map there you go that is exactly where you want to be in old town it's about uh, left hand side of the map more a bit more than halfway up uh, but there is the building anyway, it's a safe house as well so you'll see it and uh, we're going to come into this room here and on the left hand side you'll see this weird looking shrine it's like a rock with a skull on it and a, uh, and a pentagram kind of uh, shape on it and what you want to do is actually plug those two balls in that you've picked up into the skull and uh, as you'll see any second now the skull's eyes will light on fire there you go, burning away it is, they'll do that for a couple of seconds and uh, then there'll be a massive flash and a bang and underneath it as you can see the blueprint actually pops out so there it is the right hand of Glover blueprint pick that up and uh, it's an orange rarity blueprint as well so it's quite a rare one um, and uh, quite a secret one really I don't know who discovered this but uh, actually finding them two balls is quite an achievement and then knowing what to do with them is actually there but uh, we'll scroll down now and find it and uh, it's a pretty easy one to make really as well you just need a, a shed load of herbs I think it is uh, yep, herbs and alcohol and then you can make 10 bombs out of it so I'll go ahead and make them now and skip to a bit of uh, scenes of me actually taking it so basically to do this you need to have the Shadow of the King mission uh, either selected or completed as well in Old Town you'll get to that eventually uh, it's quite early on in, in Old Town so uh, it won't take too long to get to that but uh, I'm pretty sure if you haven't yet done that quest you won't be able to activate this uh, at all but what is the right hand of Glover? Well, it is the, um, it's kind of an Easter egg to uh, the gate developer's last game, Dead Island. Uh, in Dead Island, there was a uh, like a blueprint mod that you could um, get called the uh, left hand of Glover. I think it was. It was like a weird um, thing with your hand where you shot a ball of energy out and uh, stumped any enemies that were there. It didn't kill them, but it actually uh, like shocked them and stunned them, so you could go and then like stamp on the red and things like that. And uh, of course in this game they blow it back with the right hand of Glover which is kind of like a, a homemade bomb that will uh, when activated kind of sends a shock force, shock wave out basically and uh, stumps everyone, pushes them all back. Um, not the best weapon, you know, grenade in the game but uh, certainly a handy one especially for a bit of crowd control if too many people are crowding around you. Just chuck one of them down and it will just launch them everywhere. It's quite funny to see bodies fly. I think I'm actually going to take this one and test it on the bridge because there's so many enemies on the bridge. I think that'll be quite funny um, back in the slums. But uh, yeah, that's it anyway, guys. Hope you've uh, enjoyed this. If you haven't yet already got this, go ahead and get it now. Let me know what you think of it. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching, everyone. And I'll see you in the next video.